Yama again. Here we are on the top of um, Budgical Park, which is the mountain bike park. And um, we're here today to sort of have a look at some significant landmarks. And uh, over my shoulder to the right here, we can sort of see you down to uh, Warra or the Liverpool Range. And um, of course, um, over my left there is uh, Mount Turai, or Durai as they call it, um, which is uh, believed to be about um, the giant snake. And um, over further here to the north, we have um, Mount Bora. It's a big celebration area, big ceremonial place. And Bora, or um, Carbado as we call it, uh, it's all about ceremony and um, corroboree. And uh, on the other end of that, we look at um, uh, the Nandy Wars, which we head on down to um, Mount Capital and things like that. But over to our east, of course, we had the Great Divide. And these gullies play a vital part in um, everything about people that um, lived here in the beginning. Here we play, I suppose, two roles. One is to, um, uh, to comfort the people, and the other thing is to um, attract all sorts of bird and animal life because uh, this was um, a very important place. But all these creeks, they all flow into the Peel River, um, as do the um, Coburn, where it meets the Peel, uh, up at Nemingar, but also the Gunninganoo Creek flows into it as well. So all these gullies, whether they're dry or whether they do sort of um, carry some water at the moment, are all very, very important because that water goes into the Peel and then it flows off and it connects us up with other countries. Uh, further downstream and meet up with other bigger rivers. So um, this part here, of course we've, um, they all show the way, like Warra, Mount Warra shows the way down south to the Wanneroo people and um, of course Mount Turai behind me is um, heading out sort of uh, towards the Gunnizar people and um, of course we've got Mount Bora there which shows us the way north. Because um, Aboriginal people used to navigate from the top of ranges or hills because the valleys were very densely populated with um, a lot of the woodlands. So it was vital that people knew where they were going. But all the roads actually lead to these gateways, which we've known about for years. Um, but it's obvious that um, Aboriginal people have showed um, the settlers the way uh, north, you know, south, east and west. And um, all the main roads also head towards these um, um, mountain peaks, which actually um, highlights the easiest way to get to those particular places.